Yo, what is up? We are back with another YouTube video. Like I said, the weekly vlogs are coming. Decided to start this one off with a little breakfast sandwich, show you guys how I make it. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I didn't make that thing like every single day, it never gets old, super high in protein. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. We got tits and tries on the menu today, so gonna vlog that as well. Not sure what else we got planned, but yeah, gonna bring the camera along with me. Hope you guys enjoy. We do three eggs, four pieces of turkey bacon. And I'm telling you guys, don't get the Jenny O's or the whatever Oscar Mayer. Get the uncured turkey bacon. At Walmart, it's called Sam's Choice. At Sam's, it's called God Shaw's. I'm telling you, it tastes like, like actual bacon. There's more protein in it. It looks way less processed, but yeah, super fire. And then I used to use fat-free cheese, but we're bulking, so I just use regular cheese slices. Gotta have some cheese on there, you know what I mean? And then I just use regular old honey wheat bread, Sara Lee, it's fire, I like it. You don't gotta get the keto bread, you don't gotta be scared of carbs, I'm telling you guys. I've been there, I've done that, you don't need to do it. But yeah, gonna hop into this, show you guys how I do it. Also probably gonna make some protein coffee because it's heat and you guys need to know how to make that. Got that air fryer to 390 air crisp start that bad boy up but yeah let's freaking crack these eggs let's see that one-handed egg crack you think i got it oh we got a little shell in there i'm not gonna lie it's little though we'll be able to pick it out no crunchy eggs por favor i usually break two of the egg yolks and keep one for a little bit of a runny action we're golden on that one, boys and girls. Yeah, and if you're one of the people that takes the egg shells and puts them back in like the egg carton, you need to go to therapy probably. And it goes for about 10 minutes. Also use this little food saver thing. Seals it up, keeps it nice and freaking brish. If you could see what I did with the eggs there, but I broke two yolks and I kind of, I don't know what that little membrane around the yolk is, but the one yolk I didn't break, I busted that up. So it's kind of just like floating in there with all the other like mixed up eggs. But yeah, you can also use egg whites if you want. When I was cutting, I would do two eggs, break one yolk, and then do like 100 to 150 gram of egg whites in with that. But we're bulking, so we'll take three, four eggs. It's not even that much anyways. But yeah, gonna throw this on medium heat. And then the most crucial freaking part, guys, you wanna cover it. So I literally just let this sit, medium heat. I'll cook the top with this covered. And then I would say it takes like 10 minutes maybe. When the bottom starts getting a little cooked, I'll throw a little pepper on there and then throw a little Lari seasoning salt. If you've never put this on eggs, guys, absolutely game changing. But yeah, waiting for the turkey bacon. It's about at five minutes now. So it's been in for five, it goes in for 10. So I'm gonna flip them just so it's nice and evenly cooked. I used to use my fingers too. I don't know if that's crazy. It's not that hot. I feel like my fingers are at the point where like, I don't know, they're used to it. I was gonna make a, like a little edit of this, but I feel like it'd be better for me just to talk through it. Might be a little bit longer, but I think you guys wanna see this, honestly. If you want a freaking high protein breakfast where you eat half your protein goal in one sitting, this Sammy's for you, I'm telling you. Right, for the toast, what I do, so I just got normal that normal Sara Lee honey wheat bread, and then I have the, I can't believe it's not butter spray. Zero calorie, I don't think it's honestly zero calorie, but if you don't use that much, you'll be good. And like I said, it's bulking season. So I just spray each side of the toast or the bread a little bit. Get a little moist, you know what I mean? And I feel like when you throw it in the toaster like this, it just, I don't know, it toasts better. It's got a little butter on it. And then I don't like it like super freaking like done. So it's like a little under halfway. But yeah, it's a little cheat code. I feel like it makes it taste a lot better. It adds a little calories, I'm sure, but it can't be that much. I like to think it's still zero. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I got a little distracted recording. And uh, the turkey bacon went in for like a minute too long. 
It's a little crispy, but not too bad. I'm just picking it out with my hands. It's not that hot, guys, I'm telling you. But yeah, it's still good. I like a little crisp, honestly. Turkey bacon's done. Eggs are getting a little cooked, so they're getting done quick. Let's turn that heat down a little bit. The lari seasoning. There's the toast, baby. They're almost done, to be honest. This is back on for like maybe in like another minute. All right, I'm gonna show you guys how I cut the eggs. This is a freaking, this is the art of it, I'm telling you. So I could start here, break that off a little bit. On the other side, do the same thing. And then we just cut this one in half. I honestly messed up a little bit. This yolk should be like right there. So it's nice and in the middle, but it's all right, it'll do. And then I just take these corner pieces and kind of just do this. So then it like fits on the sandwich better. And I'll usually just put these like on the side and just eat them. Assembling this bad boy now. Start with the cheese, just like five G's of protein each slice. Slide that on there first. And then we do a little layer system here. The turkey bacon on bottom. We'll grab this guy over here with the yolk. Throw that on there like that, like so. We go in with another piece of turkey bacon. Grab this guy right here. Go in with another layer of turkey bacon. And then grab these side ones. And then the last piece of turkey bacon, baby. Cannot forget the sauce. My go-to, honestly, is the Cybergs wing sauce. And I honestly think that there's only Cybergs in St. Louis, so. Maybe you can order online, but it's kind of like a mustardy hot sauce. Super freaking dank. There's 40 calories per tablespoon, but in my eyes, it's worth it because it makes the sandwich taste so much better. But yeah, I usually just put like maybe one or two tablespoons, probably one tablespoon. I don't even know. I've never honestly measured it out on the top piece of bread. And then I take it and I also like kind of jiggle it around so it's like spread out a little bit. So it's not like you're getting one bite with a shit ton of hot sauce. Kind of an art to it, I guess you could say. I'm going to cover this up and then show you guys how I make the protein coffee real quick. All right, for the protein coffee, you know, we got the freaking Keurig on deck. Throw that in there. For the protein part of the coffee, don't come at me for using regular milk. You guys know how many milk emojis I use. I drink regular milk, big deal. Every now and then I'll drink almond milk. If I'm cutting, I drink almond milk, but if I'm not, like, bro, there's 120 calories in a cup, five fat, 11 carb, eight protein. Like, you're just adding protein, you know what I mean? It's good for you, it's good for the bones. I don't know when that switched up, honestly. Yeah, I do about, I don't even know how much milk that is. I don't even think it's a cup, honestly. Makes it more of like a cappuccino, I guess you could say, if that's what a cappuccino is. And then I do like a half scoop of protein. I got like cinnamon protein right here. Throw that in with the milk. And this is crucial. If you just try to throw the protein in the coffee, it just does not mix well, at least any time I try it. And then we got the frother on freaking deck, you already know. Go ahead and get this nice and frothed up. This thing is a game changer too. Like honestly, I'll use it for greens, protein shakes, everything. It just mixes it way better. I feel like almost turns it into like a cold foam. I feel like we will throw the coffee cup underneath. Get that brewing up. All right, so the coffee is freaking done, baby. That's a little Starbucks cup. I think I've had that since I was like maybe 12 years old. And you just pour, literally just pour it over the top. All right, so the breakfast is done. We got the brekkie sandwich here. Usually, guys, it honestly looks a little bit prettier. Maybe I got the jitters recording it. But yeah, looking forward to eating this. Got the protein coffee on deck. And then usually I watch some YouTube while I eat in the morning. Choice today, we got Max Tuning, of course. Very entertaining YouTuber. But yeah, going to enjoy this. Let it digest a little bit. And then head to the gym and hit some freaking titties, baby. A few moments later. 
what is up baby we are at the gym now nice little titty and tricep day going down got all the freaking subs on deck we got the vaso jet for the nice freaking pump and vascularity you got to have that a little bit of pump powder it's just straight citrulline you got to love that more citrulline more pump more blood in the muscles i mean who doesn't want that and then of course as always rocking with the game day fully loaded everything you need in this bad boy plus more take it literally every time i work out I swear by it you guys need to try it out rocking with the pink lemonade but yeah let's do a little dry scoop action get the water ready oh we got the man sports freaking insulated cup too you already freaking know start with the pre cheers Mm. Now the pump. Mm. Now the pills. Ooh. We ready now, baby. We'll catch you guys inside. Yo, what is up? We made it into the gym. Nice little titty and tricep day going down. Starting on the old incline press. Like before, we'll do a little talk and do a little bit of editing. You guys enjoy. Feeling a PR today. Quick little fit check before the pump cover comes off. We got the raw neck cloud long sleeve here. And then we got the botanical garden after party shorts. And then we got the freaking white Yeezys on, baby. Just a swaggy fit. You guys already know. Look good, feel good, perform good. How the, the titties looking, bro? All right, let's go grab the 90s and get in this freaking set. One took my 90s, man. We go to 95. I bumped some neon eyes by uh, Morgan Wong. Nice little hype song for this set. Mm. I haven't even touched a tricep yet, but they're pumping. This, this set bases how high we go up today. Feeling good though. Mm. Racing from gate to gate. Hope I don't miss my flight. This year has been insane. I hope I'll be all right. My grandpa passed last month. I hope my dad's all right. Can you say butter? Too, that keeps me up at night. I got so much shit on my mind. I had a therapist to try to help me to fit in, but I never did. So fuck fitting in. And them The 110. Take the 110s for a ride. We might go up from here, honestly. If they feel like butter, just do a couple reps and then hop up there. We shall see. May the weights be freaking light. Teachers and them lessons in those high ass classrooms we were sitting in. Just learning, lunch time burning, classroom yearning, for this money we earning. One A and straight C's, daydreams at 18. Fuck doing the same thing, and fuck chasing the same thing. We got the freaking 120s in our hands. 240 pounds in my lap, weighing 160 pounds. See if we can get some reps with it. Got a freaking spotter. Let's get it, baby. May the weight gods make this freaking light. Dreams, they say what they seem. My homies fucked up. My homies wildin' out. We can't control it. Money like Pacquiao. Ain't backing down. All you clowns ain't laughing now. So what you thinking about? Tell me what's on your mind. Lately we're talking less and drinking all the time. I never <sighs> Not bad. That's a PR for sure. <laughs> Freaking seated titty fly. I like this one a lot. I'll mix up on this bad boy. So you can do like a fly here. And then once you start fatiguing there, I think it's a little bit easier. It still works at your titties a lot. Just do a little press. Keep the elbows tight. Squeeze the titties together. So I'll just mix that up, confuse the muscles. But yeah, highly recommend it, guys. Her opened up, it keeps me up at night. So where's the bottle at? I'm in it's out Fun fact guys, I do not count my reps ever. Literally just go until like it hurts a little bit, go a little bit more. Just know your body, go until like you pretty much almost fail. And that's how you're gonna freaking grow. We rocking, we rolling, we can find a song real quick. Come on man. 
I feel like there's not, not any new music recently. One of my favorite freaking titty workouts right here. I'm all about the upper chest, upper chest enthusiast, upper titty enthusiast. Spain without the S, baby. Space the nine to five office dudes, the UA ass face. Don't see this chest variation very often. It's called the hex press. It's good for the upper and inner titty, baby. But yeah, show you guys how it's done. Let's get into the set. Bump some country, by the way. Big old country boy jerk. First. And all these haters steady in last place. We taking different paths. We both in the fast race of life. See, I ain't slept in the past days. Just writing rhymes all the time. Cajoling with a couple dimes. All right, guys. The tits are nice and frizzy fried. So moving on to the triceps. I get so many questions like, what do I do for these freaking little croissants? And honestly, I probably haven't done free weight triceps in like over a year. I used to do like skull crushers and stuff, but I honestly feel it the most. I get the best squeeze with either this W bar or the freaking tricep rope. Yeah, I do this and then we're also gonna do kickbacks on the cable and then some overhead extensions and that's honestly it. Do three to four sets of each thing, go to about failure. But yeah, let's get into the freaking set, baby. Tell I just don't complain. I just go and take what's mine. I say I'm an MC. Bitches know it. Full range of motion. Come all the way up. Push all the way down. Nice little pause at the bottom. None of this bullshit, guys. I hate when I see that. Time under tension. It's hammer time. So why you fucking hating? Cause I'm fucking famous. Lame dudes with lives unentered. Next little tricep movement, do some cable kickbacks. And honestly, usually not, wasn't a kickback fan with like dumbbells. I feel a lot more with the cables. I feel like with the dumbbell, as soon as you break here, it's like you're not getting that full squeeze. But yeah, let's get into the set. Let's hop on to the right arm. Left arm's a little too small, you know? Straight back. Keep them elbows in the same place the whole entire time. Saying it. Your message board conversators. My crew is getting smaller. Cities overpopulating. Everybody fake, man. Fuck. All right, guys. Last tricep freaking movement here. A little overhead extension. Hitting all heads of the tricep today. What am I doing? There we go. Much better. These dudes, my fifth string girl. Gosh, shit. Let's go until failure. My triceps are gonna freaking pop out the skin, guys. All right, freaking the tits and tries are absolutely destroyed. But I gotta show you guys a little physique update. 160 pounds right now. A little bit of a freaking lean bulk. You from the top floor. So what you thinking about? Tell me what's on your mind. Lately we're talking less and drinking all the time. I never opened up. It keeps me up at night. So where's the bottle at? I'm an insomnia. Not bad for 160. Up like 20, 20, like 20 to 23 pounds from Alpha Land. Still got the abs. Feeling pretty freaking good. Gonna keep pushing along the bulk. Competing probably next year, early next year. But yeah, we will see you guys freaking later. Yo, workout is complete. Tits and tries are absolutely frizzy fried. Not sure what else I have planned for the rest of the day. Might end the video here. Not sure if I got some more clips, I'll throw them in. But yeah, super foul titty and freaking tricep day. Weekly vlogs are coming, like I freaking said. So stay freaking tuned. Insomnia, 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 insomnia.